Hello everyone, my name is Rebecca Huff and I'm a member of SWAT, North Mason High School's Help Desk, and today I'm going to be talking about TED Talks and TED Ed. So let's jump straight into it. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to get on Google Chrome and we are going to search TED Talks first. It is the first one right here. And when you search just TED Talks, it goes straight to the videos where you can search and look through all the different ones and find the different topics. Um, if you just went to TED.com, I'll show you real quick. It just gives you like a home page where you can see like what's trending and the most popular um, things. But we want to go to TED Talks, so you can just go under Watch. TED Talks is the first one, and it just goes straight here. You can just search by whatever you want. If you had a keyword you would like to search, or you could just go down to topics. Um, there's more, by the way, down here. You can search by languages. So if you have a different class, maybe this would be cool for a language class. Or if you had kids who spoke in different languages, you could play a video. Um, you can have a filter for duration. So if you're teaching a class, you probably wouldn't want a 20-minute video. You probably want something short that will get the point across um, pretty quickly. And there's some more options right here. That's basically um, it. If you go on TED Talks, you're finding uh, there's a more like there's more videos in that area. Um, now we're gonna go to TED Ed, which is more filtered down to just like the educational purposes. Um, so we're just gonna open a new tab, and we're just gonna search TED Ed first one again. Um, TED Talks, like the um, talks that we were on up here, um, those are more, I would say, the main thing like I hear from those are a lot of them are informative, inspiring videos. Um, you learn a lot from them and it gets your head thinking. It definitely does. Um, but yeah, and then TED Ed is a lot more of like the educational videos. So this is the main page of TED Ed. Um, you can create a lesson if you're interested. I'm not going to get into that because that's a lot for probably you to handle at this point. We want to learn about it before we get into that. If you scroll down just right here, it says view all TED Ed lessons. That's what we want to do. We're going to click on it and it is going to load up everything. Okay, so now it is showing all the educational TED talks, I guess. Um, on the left side, it has different categories that you can use for different classes. And at the top, again, it has um, a way to filter your search. So you can have some TED Talks, some TED Eds, you know. You can pick the student level. So if you're an elementary teacher, you can play something that is aimed for younger children, um, not something that was meant for high schoolers because kids don't think the same way, you know. You, you, you know. Um, and you can do duration again, so you're not playing um, a 30 minute video to a class of middle schoolers who are going to get bored, you know, you want to play something short, and you can have some subtitles in almost every language, I would assume, which is very neat. So what we're going to do is we're just going to look through one of these real quick. Let's go with science and technology um, and see what we can do. Let's search some high school stuff and maybe we want a six minute video so as you can see there's some cool stuff here we got some stuff about chromosomes that'd be cool for a genetics class um let's see why do we itch um why do animals have such different lifespans there's some really interesting stuff on here and i really suggest you go check it out especially ted ed um and if you're just looking for some videos that get your mind thinking, I think anyone could go check out TED Talks just to see some inspirational and cool stories from people. Um, but teachers can definitely find some lessons on here, some videos. Um, it's a little bit better than YouTube because YouTube has so many different things. It's probably easier to find the educational video on TED Ed. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me. You can find me on the SWAT website, my personal blog, or my email address, which is huffreb000 at northmissionschools.org. I'd be happy to help you, and I hope you find TED Talks and TED Ed very interesting. Um, thank you for watching, and I will see you soon.